discount, sale price, and discount rate. Great day, students! Welcome back to my classroom. For today's lesson, you will learn how to solve percent problems involving discount, discount rate, and sale price. Let's begin! Let's try our first example. Leo wanted to give her mom a gift for Mother's Day. He found the dress cost 450 pesos and marked at a 20% discount. Now how much was the discount? But wait! What is discount? Discount is the amount of reduction from the original price, while the percent of discount is the discount rate. Now let's try to solve the problem. To solve for the discount, we need to multiply the original price and discount rate. Here, the original price of the dress is 450 pesos while the discount rate is 20%. Now let us multiply. But before we can multiply this, we need to change the percent into decimal. To change the percent into decimal, change the percent sign into decimal point, and then move the decimal point two times to the left. One, two. There you go. Now we have 0.20. Now it's time to multiply. 450 times 0.20. So 0 times 450 is 0. And 2 times 450 is 900. Now let's add. That gives us 9,000. But since we have two decimal places here, we need to move the decimal point in the product two times to the left. One, two. There. Now our final answer is 90. These means that the discount is 90 pesos. Great job! Let's have another example. Now this time, we are looking for the sale price. Leo wanted to give her mom a gift for Mother's Day. He found a dress cost 450 pesos and marked at a 20% discount. Now how much is the sale price? This time, we are looking for the sale price. The sale price is the amount or the price where the discount is deducted from the original price. To solve for the sale price, we need to subtract the discount from the original price. Since we know that the original price of the dress is 450 pesos, and the discount that we solved earlier, which is 90 pesos, that gives us 360 pesos. This means that the sale price of the dress is 360 pesos. Wonderful! Now let's have our last example. Sarah bought a watch which originally cost 500 pesos. She got a discount of 50 pesos. Now what is the discount rate? This time we are looking for the percent of discount. Now to get the discount rate, we need to divide discount by the original amount or original price. We know that the discount here is 50 pesos divided by the original price which is 
500 pesos. Now let's divide. 50 divided by 500. Since 50 is smaller than 500, we need to add 0. There you go. Now let's divide. 500 divided by 500. That is 1. 1 times 500 is 500. Let's subtract. And that gives us 0. But since we are looking for the discount rate or percent of discount, we need to convert or change this decimal into percent. Again, to change this into percent, we need to move the decimal point two times to the right. One, two. Now let's put zero in the empty place value. There you go. And lastly, don't forget to change the decimal point into percent sign. Now our answer is, the percent of discount is 10%. Wonderful! Great job students! You made it this far. Now here are the things that you learned today.